Hey everybody, I'm LazyDude99 and welcome to another LazyDude99 predictions video for the year of 2014 for superhero movies. Yeah. So, um... The Ninja Turtles movie. Almost forgot about that. <laughs> I wish I did. Now, when I first heard the big thing that he was making them aliens? Aliens? I was pissed! Really pissed. But then I hear, oh, you know what? Thanks to the fan backlash. I'm pretty sure this is true. I, this is what I heard. Uh, thanks to this fan backlash of that, they're no longer going to be aliens. <laughs> oh, whew. that's a relief, Mr. Bay. You know, I know you're not directing this movie. At least I don't think you are. But uh, uh, that, that really got me worried there. You know, I just alien Ninja Turtles. No, that didn't work. So, um... Okay, so they're not going to be aliens. That's good. So, um, uh, tell me, who do you have planned to play, uh, April O'Neil? No! No! No stupid little son of a... Megan Fox, are you kidding me? This is when you know that who the, who the people who are making this movie really value. No, they don't value the fans of these characters. No, absolutely not. Who do they value? They value the people that say, Oh, I want to see the movie that Megan Fox is in because she's hot. That's the movie these people are making the movie for. Not for the people who are actually fans of these characters and know them inside and out and actually want to see them in a movie. Now, well, what do we get from the trailer? Well, there is no trailer. Too late. I can't wait any longer to do this thing. And I'm not waiting on Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles for, for a trailer because it's based on Michael Bay's crap. Now, listen up. Listen carefully. What do we got from this? It's going to be the Ninja, Ninja Turtles movie, but what am I... What, okay, since we, there is no trailer, nothing to go off of, just a couple images, they're all going to be CGI. Okay, that was probably the best choice. You know what? In this day and age, to have somebody in a suit, uh, you can't move that fast, and people demand fast-paced action movies with a lot of stylistic qualities to them. So it doesn't bother me that they were going to be CGI. It, it has a weird look to them where they actually looked like a little slimmer, not as wide, but oh well. I would be okay with that as long as they're good. Uh, it looks like it's taking itself way too seriously. Have you seen some of these? They're just like, some of these turtles are just like, we're ninjas. And they look like they're like taking everything so seriously. This was based on the show that was about ninjas saying stuff like radical and gnarly and stuff like that and eating pizza for crying out loud. Don't take yourself that seriously, okay? And then the, th the fact that you just throw Megan Fox in there, a, a, a name that's almost poisoned to anything fanboyish. I mean, let me put it this way. If I was looking on the internet and it's like, uh, do, 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 confirmed that Megan Fox is in the Batman and Superman movie, no! No, I'd be done. I'd be done. Because you got to know who you value. Who do you value? And Megan Fox is a type of actress that you put in movies just so guys can see this hot chick in a movie. You don't get her because of her acting skills. It's the same with Jonah Flippin' Hex. She sucked in that, and she's not that great of an actress. All she's good at playing, I guess, is the hot chick leaning over stuff, but that's not good acting. Now you might say, well, do you really need good acting to to uh, get a movie like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Okay, it's true. You don't need anything that's like, I don't know, Citizen Kane. But the point is, people who don't like Megan Fox are people who don't like her because she was basically a dim-witted body just to look at in the Transformers movie with no actual rhyme or reason why her character was actually there. And so, we have already disliked her from one franchise, Transformers. Don't really want her to see her again in that, and they got rid of her. Good. So let's put her in another franchise with a whole bunch of fan base that people don't want her in. Where's the logic in that? What's my biggest fear in this movie? Personally, I don't care. I mean, you know what my biggest fear? You know what my biggest fear for this movie is? That it's good. And I don't mean, like, that it's okay. I mean, my biggest fear, what if this movie is actually good? And all this fanboy griping that I'm doing is actually for nothing. Because the movie's actually pretty darn good. 
That is what frightens me. What if all my fanboy griping and all this complaining is actually for not because the creators actually have some vision that I can't see and it's actually a really, really good choice and, uh, and uh, I don't know, maybe Megan Fox picks up her acting and, and really sells this April O'Neil character and really buys us that she's this type of a character and the movies pay respect to the characters. They take it seriously but not too seriously because it's a Ninja Turtles franchise. That's my biggest fear. Honestly, that's also what I'm looking forward to. That would be my biggest hope, that it is a good movie, but it's also my biggest fear, because how can we be wrong on this? How can we be wrong when first there was such bad rumors about, or bad uh, ideas about the story? Now, I, some people have said to me that they're, they are no longer aliens, that they're just going to be mutant Ninja Turtles. Good, because the fact that they were going to make them aliens, stupid, stupid, stupid. I mean, seriously, do people really think, well, let's see, the fact that these chemicals, it lands on these turtles and this uh, guy or this rat and turns them into ninja, ninja fighting people and turtles and rats. Yeah, that's, that's way too unrealistic. We know what we need. Aliens. Honestly, the only way I'll be seeing this movie is if it has, like, rave reviews about it. If people say, well, you know, it's kind of fun, but only if you turn your brain off. No, not watching it. I, uh, my excited level for it is zero. I'm not excited for this at all. I would be if it was at the hands of some different filmmakers, because... I know the Transformers movies, well, I don't really like them, they have a, a fan base. People who just like to, stu to see stuff blowing up. I was never that big of a fan of the Transformers movies to begin with, or the Transformers franchise at all. I never watched the show. Never. Not even a little. Like, okay, maybe I, I saw a little bit. I see more Beast Wars than Transformers. Let me put it that way. Now, that being said, I am a fan of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I, I may not be like liking the really old sh original show that much, but I like the remake that was made in the 2000s. I like that show uh, quite a bit, actually. And I know all the characters. We, I, it was what my, as I played as a kid, I was always Leonardo, because I like to be the leader and boss people around. So that was what I would always like to do. I was that, That's how the movie is for me. The movie is not going to measure up to my childhoods because I don't think it respects the people's childhoods or it respects the characters. It respects the making money. And who goes to see a movie with Megan Fox in it? Lots of people who just watch a movie because she's hot. That's one of the things I can't stand. When people say, I want to see this movie because this actor's in it and he's hot. Or this actress is in it and she's hot. Go watch porn if you want to watch hot people doing weird stuff. This is a movie about story and action and, and and stuff like that. I don't want I don't care if a character is hot or not. All I want to see is a good story of slave before me with entertaining qualities. So, uh, that's, that's I, I don't have anything else to say about that Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie. It's going to be like it never happened for me. Just gone. See you later. I don't care. And that's all I have to say about that. Be sure to check out more of my other videos on my channel. And wait for more coming soon.